Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Highways. We're gonna be robbing the bank. We're just gonna go the highway. Gonna go straight in and with guns blazing. All right, all right. So one, once again, is my little sneaky, sneaky. I'm gonna creep through everywhere and then just sort of just flat snipe and flank people. So I've got a Lancaster pistol which allows two shots per turn, more damage, which is nice. And then I've got and then I've got the standard repeater rifle. And then um, I've also got a petrification bolt that should hopefully help me get out of pinch and dry healing herbs. And then of course a lucky coin which gives us a bit more luck because unfortunately um we ran straight into the event which would use our luck. All right, we've got Brandon who we've got tobacco dry healing herbs just to improve our aim. To again, Brandon is. Actually, no, the, the order switched around this time. Brandon is sort of like our mid-range kind of guy, so, you know, he's your fairly standard. Kind, kind, kind of kind of person that just sort of stands somewhere in the middle. Like your normal shooter. So I've got him equipped with a six shooter and a chain rifle. Which should give a good coverage of distance. Now, all my memory, because he's got a mangled foot with minus four, with minus one max HP, I've got him to be our sniper. So I've got him with cursed ammo, and he's got pretty good aim with 55, so I've got him with the elephant rifle and the six shooter, so that should hopefully get things going. Now on the card screen, we just, I've got Queen of Space, so Chain Kill, Shadow Cloak, Shriek, Beast Hearing, and um, Smell Blood, and then um, I'm not going to go explaining through all of them, but basically uh, I've got him basically equipped as before, as I said, you know, someone who sort of just sneaks around with a lot of movement. You see he's got 26. And then, as opposed to the others, he's got 17 each. So, sneaking around, lots of movement, and just lots of flanking. Alright, so out with, um, with Brandon, uh, Golden Bullet, I think that's pretty useful just to, you know, get a, get a, uh, a solid shot. Shadow Kill, again, fairly solid. Uh, Shadow Soul, Regenerate, we're not in powerful sunlight. Um, this, this, this is kind of a so so. This one could definitely go to Warren as well, but I'm not going to worry about it too much. And then the Cannibal as well, so... Brandon's got a bunch of survivability, so like maybe I can stick him out in the middle where he can take a shot, and that's it. And then old man Murray, um, Crippler, uh, since he he's got he's got he's got kind of the best best aim out of all of them. Well, okay, I mean Brandon Brandon could definitely be the sniper, and then of course just I'm just using the red jacket to, you know, just bolster things up a bit, and then so just making sure we get some bonuses. We've got the full house bonus, which is four movement plus thirty max luck, which is nice. And then, and then we, and definitely some additional movement bonus, which is very welcome. So, without further ado, let's rob a bank. <laughs> bank was full of cash, but security was time there was demon ready to intervene should the manager call for help. Unless you recruited a madman detained in town, getting into the vault would be the challenge. Okay, there's a madman in town. Well, deputies were going about their business. They weren't expecting you. All right, let's do this. All right, uh, now that we'll be uh, all right. So the first thing I want to do is get uh. Well, firstly we're sneaking, we're sneaking around. So let's get a bunch. Firstly, we want to unlock this guy. So I definitely want to get uh Warren out. This let's just let's just make sure there's nobody around first. All right. Uh, Brandon, Brandon, what can we get you to do? Let's get you into the pub. We'll get you around, hopefully just in and around and not in and out of sight. Alright, Murray, you can go here. I mean, I mean, obviously it's kind of boring in given that, you know, we just, um, just have to do kind of a general setup at the moment, but, um, yeah, I mean, what can you do? Uh, should probably just double check something, and, uh, before I go on. So... Alright. Restore. Okay, that works. Alright, um, now what I want to do is basically kill or subdue the manager. And um, it says destroy the telegraph. Now, we, 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 I don't want to destroy the telegraph because I want to kill more people. I definitely want to open the jail door. And now uh, we want to try and kill as many people as possible. Alright. Now, Mari, can I get you somewhere maybe that's like upstairs or something? Because you're the one with the sniper rifle. So, it would be nice if I could get you upstairs and just sort of just sniping from the rooftops pretty much. Alright, it looks like I can get you up here. I guess the question is um, where from upstairs I should get you going. So, we'll get you inside the pub first. And we'll get Brandon. We'll get Brandon inside as well. 
I don't like that sound. <laughs> Alright, so Okay, let's uh let's get let's get Warren inside. The burly man they called the child eater greeted you with a nod. He had heard of you. Nice to have a reputation sometimes, other times not so much. Alright, let's get Where are the stairs? Let's get you upstairs. We'll get Brandon. I feel like I should just jump right in here. But maybe... Because cause basically I want Brandon to have like a flanking position. So um, I'll, get, I'll get him around the back door over here. That should, that should get him in a good spot. Alright. Let's subdue. <gasps> Five turns. Okay. Now... Brandon, get you out here. And basic, basically, I want to get Brandon in a spot where I'm sort of close to the manager as well. But uh, uh, so, uh, so somewhere where I can just sort of run away and hide behind full cover whenever necessary. Mari, let's let's see if we can get you upstairs. I, you can't actually go upstairs. That's actually pretty disappointing. That's actually pretty disappointing. All right. Um. Let's get my... Actually, over here would be good, because then he'll have a full sight all the way down there, and then he can sort of back up Brandon. Okay, let's... we'll do that. Alright. Alright, you can... An honorable man in his own way. He resolved to return the favor. Alright, let's switch Murray to the sniper rifle, and then we'll get him over here. And then I'll get him behind that building. And this guy, now, he's got a baby number nine. I wonder what that is. Uh, I, I know he's got a cone shot, and he's got a golden Derringer. The Derringer means he can shoot twice, which is going to be pretty useful. Um, so, yeah, so for now, we'll just get him move a little bit closer. Not that much of a big deal. Alright, let's um let's get Brandon over here. Hopefully there's no one in there. Okay. Excellent. Now Warren. Okay, Brandon, where should you go? Uh, let's get you over here. No, let's um probably should look around the corner first. Alright, not to worry, there's Murray, we'll get him over here. Alright, Chow Eater. Ugh, what kind of name is that, seriously? Uh, now this is two more turns, so... Get Chow Eater over here. About to attack. Alright, let's stick, let's stick him up. <laughs> Alright, Brandon's in a good spot. Uh, I wonder if I could kill the bank manager from behind there. Let's see, move over here. Okay, can't see the bank manager. Alright, my, my behind here, that's good enough. And let's try and get everyone else petition. So, he's got five. Child Eater can... Alright, Child Eater can, uh, well, assuming he hits both shots, he'll be able to kill... He'll be able to kill, kill him on his turn. So, we'll have him move over here and look out the window. Alright. Now we'll have Warren, I guess, I, we'll get Warren over here, I guess. That's, that seems like a fairly reasonable distance to shoot from. Alright. And he's still within the shadow, so he can still sort of hide around. Alright, um, let's get... Okay, I don't want to get too close, but I do want to flank this guy, so let's... Get over here. And Murray is good. Alright, we'll backspace. Alright, time time for action. Alright, there's somebody here which is interesting. Uh, I should probably be careful with that actually. Can I sneak around the back? No, alright. Um I think we'll deal No, actually, 
<laughs> I should play this safe. So, Warren goes here. Let's take a look. All right, there's one guy there. Um, is this a flank? No, that's actually not a flank, which is kind of disappointing. So, the, the problem is, I don't know if I can actually kill him in one shot. No, okay, so I will at least move him here. Take a peek inside. There's the bank manager. And um, I guess, Murray, if I had to take a shot, you could definitely kill that guy in one go with the scope shot. Okay, um... So that's the plan. One guy in there, one guy, the bank manager, and then um, he would take out the bank manager. He would take out this guy, and this. Well, he is a Lancaster pistol. I can get, I can shoot twice. Um. All right. Okay. So who else has still got a turn? Murray. And all right, they're good. Okay, showtime. Let's shoot. No, I want to shoot this guy. Confirm. You freaking miss! Holy crap! Well, fifty-nine. Well, it's better than. Ooh, that's very much overkill, but, um, it's very much overkill. Alright, you, we're, no, first we've got to kill this guy with Murray, so, we'll take a scope shot, and we want to kill this guy, and go. And a Murray. Alright, and now we're going to take this. To target with the active weapon, 64% is not good. Um, yeah, of course, I would miss. What a time to be alive! And sarcasm. All right, so what's the best idea? I think the problem is he, he's got a nice flank, so Warren can take one shot, but that's about it. So I, I, I need to move, so I, uh, I was not expecting this to happen. So Warren's gonna have to go in here. And he will take a shot at the bank manager. Yep. Alright, so he's ran out, which makes him flankable. And. Alright. Grand is handling well. Alright, so he is... Okay, yep. So he's flankable by Murray. Alright, so the safe is here. Okay. So you had to kill the manager first. Alright, so shadow kill. I feel like I should do it while I can. But first, first let's see... Okay, so there's two guys. Alright, Murray, what can you do? Um, you haven't got anyone inside, so that actually kind of sucks. So what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to get you... ...over here and reload. And then that way, you can you can take out whoever's in, whoever's in view. Alright, you... where can Chao Ito? Alright, you kind of exactly crossed the hallway there. Uh, you're out of ammo as well, except for you. 54, that's half cover, that's not all that good. Now, uh, should... Someone's over here, so... How far can you move? Okay, you can move here and flank. But I have a... Yeah, you're gonna need more than one shot to kill him, so... We'll get you moving here, that should get you. Repeater rifle, alright, let's take a shot. 70%, let's do this. And you how far can you, you can't you can't really hit that guy, which is actually kind of a problem. So Charlie, what can you do? Can you can you get upstairs here? No, okay. 
Um, all right, well, you haven't moved, so I'll get you to reload like this one. Shot 31. Is this it? This is a. I don't know what kind of weapon that is. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I can actually pull up like an option screen to, to see what's happening. <laughs> um, but we'll, we'll definitely. feel like I should. I mean, I should knock him. If I can hit him once, that would still be some. So, and um, I can get someone who, who can hit, who can shoot, hit, hit with 5 damage just to kill him. So now I oh, no, all instructions and never misses. I mean that's kind of alright. So what I want is let's just do a shadow kill. It's a guaranteed kill, and I think we can definitely take advantage of that. It's kind of cheating, but yeah, I mean we'll work with it. Alrighty. Now you're out in the open, and you're flanking. Oh. Oh, oh, Chow Eater got hit. That's Upon the near side of the fields, even the sun averted its gaze. Well, we've got one advantage to all our new open, so. Which is, which is nice, which is nice. I mean, it, it gives us this, gives us a free, sh free shot at them. Now, I need to, I need to move this guy back. Now, do I have anything that can do 5 damage? I don't think so. Alright, so Shadow Q is not going to work. Golden Bullet, I don't have enough luck. So that's actually going to kind of be a, be a problem. So what I should... Take a shot with Mare first. So we'll take a scope... Or oh, let's see, 69, 69. Alright, we'll take a scope shot with... um. Actually, we'll leave Murray did for last because he can hit all three. So I want to see what um, Chow Eater can hit first. So let's shoot. 59 with 9. Okay. I mean, if I, if I, if I kill him, that's great. You missed! Oh my goodness. This is infuriating. Um, okay. So... What I don't want to do is... This guy needs to stay alive, so I need to basically... 74, 74, 74, okay, so... I'm gonna hide behind full cover. Take a shot at the demon. 74. Yeah, it's not the best, but you will have to do. I feel like maybe I should use a shriek as well, but um... Yeah, okay. This is gonna be a problem. So, six shooter... We'll chain rifle 100, 100, 76, 70. Uh -oh. hmm. Ah, I could have fanfared. Oh well. Okay, let's shoot this guy. <coughs> Alright, Murray, what can you do? You can do a scope shot. I feel I feel like I should kill him because he's an easy target. But but, but I think I think it's much easier just to just to yeah kill a demon. So that's all right. All right, fingers crossed. Oh shit! He can shoot shoot a freaking window. That is all kinds of lame. Child Eater misses another one, and he's gonna flank. Oh, he's gonna reload. Oh, I right, am pretty lucky there. No, not. I mean, obviously, you are such a good crack shot. And then, oh, you're gonna. Wow. Oh, that's gonna hurt. All right, you need to deal with this guy. Uh. Jesus, okay, um, how, how close can you get to this guy? Um, okay, I can sort of just get around like this and flank him. 
from from behind, so that works for me. So I'll do that right now. Just get him out of my face, really. 64, 60. All right. Oh no! <sighs> All right. Take it easy. Now, um, what do I want to do here? Um, okay, him I want to hide somewhere. Can I... Can, first, let, first let's see what I can hit with Murray. I think Murray, I just want to take care of him first. And um, the demon's getting a bit close, which is a bit of a problem, so I'm going to pull back. And just take one one shot with the with the six shooter. All right, sixty nine. Oh my, I need, need your luck for. Oh fuck. Wrong one. Wrong one. Okay, so what can you do? Chow Ito, what can you do? I wonder. Okay, so let's get Brandon back here. I'm gonna hope. No, the demon can probably move here and flank him, which is gonna be a problem. So. I wanna pull back this way. And if I take out a demon, that's actually pretty good. The problem is, the problem is someone can see me through that window here. So. I feel like this is the best option. Here, over here. One move, one move, one point. We'll take a shot. Is it a better percentage chance? No, okay. Well, I can do a golden bullet. Okay, I, I need the golden bullet. <laughs> I can't afford to take chances here. Um, Alright, who's remaining? Chow Eater. Chow Eater, you're kind of in a useless position at the moment because he's like. You're like there, but you're not being useful. So now I'm gonna hope Warren can take a single shot because he definitely needs to chase that guy down. Um, shall we eat away? Can you go? I mean, I feel like I feel like uh, maybe I should get Charlie to go around as well because the the other thing that would be nice is that. Because basically there's two ways you can go through here, it's one through the front, pardon me, and one through the back. So I think I'll have Charlie to go through the front. The, the question is now how do I maneuver him such that I can get him to, you know, be a bit more, I guess, convenient in that regard. So, smooth Charlie to... Um, it's either here, but he won't get a shot. Or I could be being here, but he will still have a shot. I think, and I, I, I still want a shot. So let's see, let's see what you, what you can hit with the Daringa. All right, if you can kill that guy, that would be pretty nice. All right. All right, take care of that. Oh, okay. Now he's hiding as well, which is. All right. Well, Murray, you're gonna use the six. The. All right, Warren, you better hit this one. <laughs> oh my goodness. Go. All right, much better. Um, now how did you recover health? I wonder. Uh, but you can definitely do a shadow kill, but that's probably a big overkill. So, Murray. You're going to take out this guy. That's a nice flank right there. Alright, 6 damage? Oh, that's right, you do 2 damage. Okay, um, now there's a demon out there. Um, I could actually flank him if I... No, I can't flank him. I'm, I'm quite annoyed, actually. Um, so let's reload the baby number 9. And then we'll see what... Okay, tree damage. All right, that's not all that great. So I feel like maybe let's just reload everything. And what can 
Brandon do? All right. You know what? I will get you to use the herbs. Grant healing over time. Okay. So I don't know. Don't exactly know how much you. All right. If you deal five damage to an enemy not protected by sunlight. I mean. Or let's let's. What else can? Seventy four. Seventy four is pretty good. We'll shoot with the chain rifle then. All right. All right, that was a reload. Now Warren can start moving in from the back. Let's let's hope he doesn't run into too much trouble. And for now, I'll just have him reload his Lancaster pistol. Now he's he's reloaded, so mate flank the demon from the back. It'd be nice if I could get him close on. And, okay, there's nobody here, so they've definitely moved, which is... It's alright. Um, now, Shadow Kill. Uh, actually, let's just... Where, where is Murray right now? Murray? Alright, Murray, you, you, you definitely can't hit anything today, so I'm gonna get you back here and... Uh, reload your elephant rifle. Or well, it should be your sniper rifle, really. Um, Alright, Chow Eater, uh, not much you can do really, um, so I'll get Brandon do his thing, we'll, we'll do a Shadow Kill, so he, he's so cheap, he's so nasty, I love it, alright, now, Chow Eater, let's get you over here with the... We'll pull up and then we'll get, get some vision into the bank as well. Alright, so open the safe. Now I don't know how many how many more people are in here. We could do definitely double check all the We could definitely double check all the all the all the squares I suppose. We just see which one we can't move to and that will sort of just indicate which one where they are. Oh, okay, there's one guy there's one guy still here. So we could definitely have Brandon move over here and take a shot 59 74 can we do a golden bullet yes we can man this is cheating but I love it all right uh char eater where can you move I want you to move closer I want you to get some vision of inside but I don't know where the last demon is. I know there's someone in there. Um, and you can't move far enough in there. You, how far can you move? Can you? I'm just checking the tiles again just to see where he can't move. Because that would give me an idea of where the demon is. But it doesn't seem to be anywhere that I can see. Maybe I'm miscounted how many demons I've killed. Well, for now, oh, I don't think you'll hurt to take a peek in. Because then I could always just move back if I need to. Alright. So, I'm, no, that's the chair. I'm an idiot. Okay, who else? Who else has still got to move? Uh, you? Let's get you... To the side here, and we'll just reload your daring girl. I mean, I know I'm playing it, like, really, really safe at the moment, so it must be kind of annoying for some people, but when you're, when you're playing on the hardest difficulty, sometimes it's just like, well, you know, I'm just not going to take, I'm just not going to take my chances. Alright, so, Murray, 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 let's get you into half cover over here, looking in. And we'll see. Alright, so... Alright Murray, you're, you're up on the front. Let's take a peek in, see if there's anybody there. Alright. Alright, I think I'm probably wasting wasting time here, so let's get let's get Warren right in there. Your pockets brimming with wealth, you set out to leave. With all adversaries dead at your feet, you left. Ah, 
Okay, while well, looting the town used to encounter many people, um, kill any men who might put up a fight when you kill everyone regardless of age or gender. Let's kill everyone. Oh, holy shit. That is 40 people. By your hand, by your diversity, settlements cease to exist. Terror spread, spread through the land, many of the shop owners just up and left town closing the shops for good. The stranger showed up right on cue, congratulated on the job well done, then he offered a boon of your choosing. Um... Ask for cash lost a bit. Ask, ask for guns and equipment. Don't need guns and equipment. Let's go for it. Eventually, elite. people fled in abject fear simply upon hearing your name. Alright, we gotta rate the masked man's hideout. There's, all right, there's still a bunch of graves we need to explore. I feel like we should skip them. But, um... Yeah, and there's also still the Indian totem. Let's, let's, let's take a look at it. Let's take a, take a look at everyone so far, because... Alright, the skull here well, what was lost in the intellect was made up in speed and luck, so minus 4 side 2 movement, 1 max HP, 10 max luck, that's pretty good actually. Um, and now I've got 4 people, so let's um, we should probably... Alright, Chow, he does pretty good. My... Lame late, your scars slow you down but make your dodging unpredictable. That's pretty good. 10 defense, minus 2 movement, so Mari is still our sniper. Shredded hands, if you hit hand damage, reduces gun skill, minus 10 aim, minus 1 max HP, that's not good. Not good, I'm not gonna lie, so, um... I feel like I should sacrifice somebody. <laughs> oh, um... Gosh, what do I do? You know what? I, 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 I like everyone. I like everyone. We'll keep, we'll keep everyone. And, um, so let's head down to the fake trade to see what he's got in his stock. Um... Grouse exceptional wares. So, what does Chow Eater have? He's got a Golden Daring Gun of Baby number 9. So, I think he's kind of fine in that regard. So, what I need to really do is just sort of investigate um, what other options there are in store for me. But um, for now, we, we, we definitely have one more thing to do, and that's head to the Master's Man hideout. So, um, that will definitely be the last thing we do. So, in the meantime, before this, he no doubt prepared a warm welcome. <laughs> Alright, so that's definitely that's definitely the last mission of this session, so I will wrap up this video here. Once again, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please hit the like button and subscribe if you'd like to see more. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to dealing with the Masked Man, and of course I will do some preparations in the meantime and explain what's going on in the next video, in which I will see you. Bye-bye.